Hey guys and welcome to a Ragman task guide, The Blood of War Part 3. You need to find and mark 3 fuel stashes on woods and you also need to survive and leave the area. You do need to mark them, so you need to buy markers. The way you buy markers is, is if you head over to Prepper Tier 1, down on the right hand side you can see the MS2000 markers for 14k and you will need to buy 3 of them. Now let's head over to Woods. Okay so now we're inside Woods. You can see that I'm next to where the plane crash is which is also next to Jaeger's hut which is just down there. So the best place, to, the best way to get to this first location is if you're at the back of the plane and you see this rock here. If you just run just left of this rock in a straight line. All it will do is it will take you up a hill and you'll be directly next to the stash. Which is this dash on your right hand side here. Okay, so the second stash, we're at the south entrance of the map where the vehicle extract is. We're next to the mountain where the sniper scab likes to snipe everyone. If you continue following this mountain on your left hand side, you'll get to an open cave. Inside that open cave, is where the stash is. So just keep following it and then it should just start to curve around and then here you go. This is the second fuel stash. Okay so now we're at checkpoint. Up this road is the lumber mill and up this road in this direction is scav house once you're at checkpoint if you look to the right side of the road you can see this giant rock here the stash is actually hidden around the back of this rock so on the left side just here is where the final fuel stash is. But guys, hopefully you found this guide useful and I'll see you in the next video.